Are we there? Yep. Stanford Pledge of Allegiance, please. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible, but repeated justice for all. Yeah, call the meeting order. I'll make the motion to approve the agenda. I'll second that. Okay, all in favor? All right. Aye. Uh, read the minutes and make a motion for approval for October 22nd. All second. Any uh, discussion? If not, all in favor? Aye. Meetings attended, please. Uh, I had an EMS meeting in Morning Sun. Um, they turned in their paperwork and we talked. We uh, did spreadsheets on all the equipment that the three ambulances own, um, the dates and the mileage of the ambulances and the dates of the equipment to categorize them from oldest to newest. Looks for the most part, uh, most ambulances services have pretty much what they need to function. There's a few um, defibrillators and stuff that we'd write a grant for it or look into the future. Um, but everybody seems to be pretty well equipped. There's some maintenance issues that we're gonna resolve in the next month or two on a couple of ambulances, but nothing too outrageous. Uh, I got last month's, um, of course, submittals. I just got this month's submittals. I'm starting to do a spreadsheet on the amount of money that we're expending so we can keep track of that. Um, and I know what our balance is. So we'll be watching that. As the data comes in after months, we'll we'll be able to forecast a little better where we're at. And our, when you do the books, are you going to do it by department too? Where you can get a... Uh, yes, yes. Put, it'll be combined, but each department will have its own separate spreadsheet. So right now I've only got two months worth of data. It's not really relevant, but once we get three, four, five months in, then we'll be able to see trends and um, track stuff a little better. I told them that we wouldn't probably buy any major equipment at least in the first six months because we want to see how the first six months go and what we have for reserves and whatnot. So I was thinking about that the other day too, Sean, that on the manwoods reports, it probably would be good if the supervisors still see them monthly, but they would see their whole books now since it's totally funded. They're so supposed to still be submitting them. I just want to all I'm getting is the, the, the what they're turning in for money. But yeah, they should still be turning their because I didn't see one for you. No, so not for a couple months. Okay. So mm -hmm. right. a month and a half, month and a half. So that's why I just want to make sure it don't stop. I'll let them know. So okay. is that is that I got a question? Huh? Is that will that be audited to, to our normal audit procedures? So yes, I, the the group turns it in to me. I review it. In fact, I struck one line item off one of them this month because it wasn't allowable, and then it goes to the auditor, and then it's on our claim sheet. So all three supervisors review it. So there's two steps before it's approved and then and then like it is also seen by the auditor that we hire for the county yeah the, at the end of the year they audit everything right. yeah 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 and that's a good question i had uh go ahead and look at the books for what we did for the past this this year also too so i baby yeah that's on anytime there's money going in sometimes we have to point them in that direction but it's you're right, right. especially if it's a new one, you know, yep. they've always did you know the routine, and then yep. here there's a whole new account. Yep, thank you. Yep, so Sean, are you the chairperson of that? Either? Yeah, yeah. Um, the only other thing was solar that's um at the complex is moving forward. REC had an easement to trench in some power lines, uh, we granted them that, and they're working on this L shaped solar panel it's down the um east side of the jail and then it kind of curls up into the north side a little bit um and 
they acted like they're going to get started and hopefully have most of it in before the end of the year. So we'll see. Well, I had no meeting. The only thing I had is uh, uh, getting prices on uh, for the trailers um, for the transfer station. Just we're going to be coming up in another week. Um, yeah, a bunch of other stuff just issues. So. I did have one thing that I want to bring up to the supervisors. I had um a couple of people, citizens, reach out to me with concerns on the trailer park. One yeah. individual had made a couple of visits, home visits to the trailer park. Um the uh, the, the easiest way to say it is the conditions at the trailer park. And those two locations are not good. Um, water issues, um, heating issues, and um, bug issues. Yeah, uh, there's kids involved. Um, I, I talked to them a little bit about DHS, and they kind of acted like DHS wouldn't show up unless it was imminent danger of children dying. Um, they did help out this one family in particular and, and got their heat going and, and worked on their water and plumbing, but I already know what his excuse is going to be. You know, he sells the, the, his trailer on contract. So now all of a sudden it's their problem, not his problem. So we've been down this path. Their question to us was what could we do to help? And I told them really the only power that we had was to hold them accountable for zoning. I mean, broken windows and trash and and just hold their feet to the fire on that regard. So I guess I'll make a pass out through there and see how the trash pile's going. I know there's a really big one there a while back. I don't know where it's at now. If you guys one of them got cleaned up, cleaned up. Yeah, but the one were kind of by the road. Yeah, the one by the road got was up. taller than the trailer. Yeah, and you can dim it. We'll have to look and I see don't know. what our legal. You ain't got much time, Brad. The school it's well, so, thing be is, is upset. Anyway. They've lost so, I mean, the kids. They've looked out of there. So the school well, has felt the impact of it. Maybe we'll address it. So it's it's there's a problem, and I know he says there's no problem, but we all know there's a problem. Well, I had two phone calls for apartments because they lived out there, same thing. Yeah, and um, I don't have anything. Conditions just aren't livable. He's selling these trailers, and they're just they're not habitable. And I don't know who else to turn to, and they don't either. Well. It, it would be uh, planning and zoning. We'd have to maybe have it address that, put some things in there for we can monitor down the road. It probably it definitely needs to be there, but it needs to have a little bit that more teeth. Kind of falls on Brian's yeah. keys. Maybe we'll get it on the yeah. next agenda and just have and it out there yeah. and see if there's any other criteria okay. we can use. Let's we'll let's try to get that on the next agenda so we can just kind of have some place. discussion about it. And, Will be two months before you get a I know, policy in place. We, we got to start yeah, now. At least get it. At least start now. Yeah. Okay. That's that's all I had. Okay. Any more public input? <clears throat> Real fast. Okay, I got a call on the uh, food pantry, and they're going to put handrails up, and they're all doing this with the. Uh, uh, donated and volunteer labor. We just need to give them grant permissions. I told them we're just doing it right here this morning. And so that's one number seven. If I can, uh, and they, uh, it's just a railing. I think it's going to be a wood railing. There's kind of a slope right there and just a uh, habit where they can pull themselves up. I think they're going to put a med rail in too for those that's in a wheelchair, stuff like that. I mean, but, right at the door. Yeah. To the side. Right. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. And I told them I'd help if I could. So, but uh, no, they're not asking for anything from us. So, so I just need a motion. I'll make a motion that we uh, let the donate people put in the donated handrails to the food pantry. I'll second that. Any more discussion? 
If not, all in favor? Aye. Aye. No. no payroll changes? No payroll changes. Okay. Any more uh, movement on the LP tank? Um, I had to leave that last time. They got uh, still trying to find a replacement pop off and regulator because they have to be replaced. Okay. And I'll uh, touch base with them. I'll, I'll send the Justin Ingram text right now and see what you find out. You have um, Adam's. Did um, the auditor's office get that one contract for the solar at the complex sign and sent back? Do you know? Uh, as far as I know, it was okay. I, think Brad I signed it. Yeah. Okay, good. Okay, good. Good. Any word around the head of the schedule, so whenever you get a chance. Okay, thanks, Mike. I did have early childhood development email me and and ask if all the boards are that time of year, and I told them that we were basically getting a new board with the exception of me. And as of right now, I was still on it, but until we get the new board members in place. I didn't know how it was all going to get divided up. So she said that was fine. Yeah. And way that we've done it previous, as soon as the election's over and it's all verified, uh, then sometimes we'll ask the new ones if they want to start. Because I went to like three months then. early. I went to your state. Okay. Meetings. So that way you get on the ground and run in. Well, elections next. It was Tuesday. Yeah, yeah. Verifications at 12. Um, it's actually, we're probably going to have to have a special meeting. Um, there's some stuff in the works with the SOS, so we'll probably have to have a board meeting on the 13th to canvas the votes. Yep. Okay. Because of the 11th being a holiday. Veterans Day. Oh, don't we have something on Monday, Tuesday, the 11th? Don't we? Isn't there something at the courthouse on the? I think it was the 12th. About the purple. I think it was before our meeting. Mm -hmm. Wasn't it? That's what we discussed. But I, thought, I thought they were going to move it because there was a conflict. Or is that the day that they decided to move it to? That's what I thought. Because of the school not being there on Monday. Okay. It was going to go to two Tuesday morning. Stuff. Okay. That's the way I remember it. Anyway. Let me ask Adam. Maybe he'll know. The Thank you, buddy. Dedication for the Purple Heart stuff. You don't know nothing about it. I don't recall. <laughs> okay. Veterans Day. Nothing. No, it's going to be on Tuesday. And the supervisors have their meeting on Tuesday morning. We can't go in there eight, right? And then he, yeah. he, he, he talked like maybe he tried to get it redone, and then I don't know. I, I, I don't it's know. It's kind of left up in limbo. But yeah, yeah. I did, but I, I thought Brad said something about you guys and take a recess if you had to. But yeah, well, it was suggested, okay, but I don't know that it was stamped, stamped and time. approved. The van, the van was first period, and that's when they were going to do it. I'll talk to Kurt. He's in charge. <laughs> Morning. Morning. Um, not going on, going on out there. Uh, more like late on and on and things like that. We're kind of doing a career work for the year. Um, maybe a few odd, oddball things if, if the weather is, is warm, but nothing too, too major going on right now. Um, things coming up. Uh, got that bid letting for the Grandview D28 asphalt work on uh, uh, 
November 19th, just getting through the, through the DOT. Um, in the office, we're working on bridges and plans for the next round. Um, have to agree at things that uh, I got really to, to, to you. Um, I connected three weeks of training and said we, we can apply for, for as many as we want to. So I'm going to do a couple projects. I'm going to do that bridge on the a road and the safety project over on uh, it's 37, I guess, or what I've been put in for. There's any buildings or anything you can uh, do something like that. If you need to know from me, I can I cannot give you him. So. Um, other than that, not a lot, not a lot going on in it really. So, regular stuff. I'm about a grant for a salt shit. Uh, I, I don't know that that I, I I could do that. I don't know that that's re regionally uh, significant, but 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 I would yeah significant to us yeah for region. Yeah. So don't say that on the no, no, that's right. Yeah, uh, re 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 regionally significant. So I figured a bridge on the K Red, which connects local grain to the river and try and all that would be best I could I could come up with. So. <laughs> Plus, if I can get that money to fund by grant, just make it yeah. the money go else elsewhere. So mm -hmm. that's an Eastern Iowa port. So. Mm -hmm. It's a grant from Southeast yeah. Regional Planning. Yeah, but it would be part of that whole conglomerate. It could definitely help the. Yeah, I, it it could help the uh, up, 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 upgrade the situation. I refer sure. to it. Yeah. Yeah. Um. There's also a, a a raise grant, which is part of the part of the, the <coughs> federal thing. Um, I, I submitted for that last week, and I threw in the. I, I I'm trying to get all of the 99 done from Wapple all, all the way down to the county line, as through various projects. Uh, you, know, you know, through uh, root regional planning, I've got from X61 down in that grant. Um, but I'm trying to see if I can jump ahead and get cut concrete from X or from the bridge all the way down and get both both the over three down. So I'm just that's kind of our our our, our biggest issue. So I'm just throwing as many grants at it as it as I can, and hopefully one will come, and then if that gets done, I can do more else elsewhere. So kind of where are where where uh where I'm at grants and stuff like that. So. There's 92 coming. Um, drove up there this morning. They've got the main line done, getting pretty close to X17. They're really? past the avenue heading east. And they managed as they're doing it to four of the, the north shoulder as well. So they have to come back and do the south one, but making making progress. I'm hoping <laughs> later in the week they're getting pretty much done with paving. I'll say to come back. Are their weather windows going to start closing up real quick? Yeah, yeah. yeah. I mean, it's supposed to be about 74 today or something like that. I mean, tomorrow. And then, yeah. So hopefully they can get as much much as they can and, and get, and get it open. Uh, Mike and Justin are at the meeting now. So open by Thanksgiving. You know, it's not my project. <laughs> looks I was hoping like, he'd stick his neck out. Like yeah, that. Yeah, We're yeah. online, everyone. I should feel like I looked out. Looking okay. Okay. But it's not my project. So. <laughs> Weather related. Weather related, yeah. Down on X61 right there where they, uh, David used to stop. I remember we was talking this summer when they got the crops out. We was going to open that uh, drainage issue with all the uh, oh, talk weeds, yeah, and stuff yeah. like that. Is there a chance that we can get in there before we have to worry about spring? Uh, we we got that on the, on the list. Um, I'd like to get get that cleared out a little bit. Um, Pretty thick. Yeah. Also, like to do some of the tree tri tri trimming up to the north there along those houses and kind of get everything hanging. I, just, I didn't know if it's still on your radar. So I, yeah. I drove down through the other day and I see now it's really came out closer to the radar. Yeah. So, yeah. Um, uh, I don't know if you noticed, but uh, to the south of there, there's some trees that were growing back to the ditch. And we, we went and actually mowed yep. backwards on that and 
Got a bunch of those. We, we just break their trees, it looks like, too. Yeah. Um, There's a lot of dead ones. I don't think we did much spraying there. We have been using the new tractor cat that's up, up there gotcha. on G, upper four X, and around the sheriff's, sheriff's park road, using that arm. Get yeah. the dead sheet and stuff like that. So yeah, it looks good. Yeah. yeah, I know it's them. I don't know whether we can put in there to get rid of them, but they're pretty quick in there. Yeah, I, I would like to, um, you know, activate a channel like a foot wide and, and a rocket. You yeah. know, hopefully it wouldn't, wouldn't come up. I just haven't wanted to spend the money, but maybe it's a good time to do that and get that done. So. Is there anything else? Mm -hmm. going to start. I going to start the bridge over the K Road. They say. Oh, um, looks like the approaches are ready. They quit working on them. Anyway. Yeah, they've got to let the earth uh, sit there for like 180 days or something. Okay. They might come in and pound piles and, and things like that because it's kind of independent. Right. I I suspect. He, You'll see some work on it over the winter. He told us they were they were pushing him awful hard to get in there yeah. and work on it, but he wasn't gonna let it. Yeah, <laughs> for sure, for sure. So um and it sounds like over the next month they're gonna do uh, a lane closure to get that patch, but I'm not sure if that's so there's been talk about them doing that, uh pushing and getting a crane in there to get the pot or to get the yeah, the Pilings. The pilot's done. So I suspect we'll hear more, more about it. But they sure made a mess out of there at Ravine, north of Harbison's. Holy moly. Uh, yeah. <laughs> there ain't no Ravine there anymore. Wow. <laughs> yeah. Looks like they're starting to maybe a borrow down where you turn the uh, Northfield Road. Okay. Yeah. I don't know that one goes there, but it looked like they were going down into the ground. Yeah, they own pulling out dirt, so I don't know if they yeah, yeah. not for sure on that one, but well, lots of activity out there for sure. Probably 30 people working. Yeah, anything else? Hmm. Nothing else. Okay, all right, guys. Thank, thank you. Thank you. I'll make the motion to adjourn. Second, <laughs> we need to adjourn. Thank you. Oh, yeah, All right. Yeah, we have some stuff.